Hey, what's going on, people, and welcome to a Fortnite season four <laughs> video. It's the first season four video I'm actually going to do for the channel, and I want to try and do this for every single season from now on. So this is the season four new things that we actually have for people to find, people to get from the battle pass. So uh, hope you enjoy. If you do. Please remember to like, subscribe, and remember to click the notification as well, and follow me on Twitter and everything that you want, guys want to do. Um, it's nice to have people to do all that type of stuff. So, I will see you guys in a second when I go over all the stuff. So, as a start, I'm going to do this as fast as I can. So, that means you guys don't have to watch 17-minute video for everything that I actually have. So, for starters, the battle pass is at 900 credits as normal. And for people who bought the season 3 one, they actually get 5 tiers for free. So, that's very nice. And for everybody who is addicted to getting all these type of things, it's nice to have. Number two, the second thing that you actually... Well, the first thing you get from the Battle Pass is actually the Carbine skin, which is the first customizational skin that you can get. The first upgradable skin, really. So, um, from level 1 to 65 of the Battle Pass tiers, you actually get new parts for the Carbine skin, which is very nice to have. And then, along with the Carbine skin, you do get another skin, which is the Battle Hawk one, which actually looks like the character from Ice Age. You know, the uh, dinosaur one, that one, the, the thing, the character that Simon Pegg played. That one, I'll put a picture on the screen for you, as you guys know what it looks like, really. So moving on, we've actually got a load of other things, so including a sugar cane type, that's a sugar candy type character called Zoe, um, a hooligan type person which has spray cans and um, looks like a tracer skin of the spray paint thing, picture on screen here. And, um, you know, we've got a load of things. We've got the Wonder Woman skin, we've got the Wonder Woman variants, and we've actually got another customization uh, character right at the end at level 100. And the level 100 one is called Omega. I don't know when you can actually unlock all these things level 100. I'm not out yet. I don't want to buy stuff. I don't have money. But um, it might be towards the other challenges thing, which is the same as the car buying challenges, but instead you have to complete five other week challenges so you have to complete the whole oh no seven week challenges so you have to complete the whole challenges for the one week and then do that another six more times so really it, it could be any of them it could be any of them between the 10 weeks but um as soon as you do that one you do get the i don't know what it is i'm gonna guess a skin because it does look like it's a cut out of a character so it could be a skin it could be uh the same thing as what um carbine is so who the hell knows about this also for anybody interested in the battle pass as well uh there are 15 coin unlocks so that means you get uh 1500 unlockable things so that means if people do want to get through the whole 100 tiers you do get that many so that means you're ready for season 5 as soon as it comes and um you know it could be anything really it literally could be anything but we've got to wait another 10 more weeks to get that one. So that's another 70 days um, for Season 5. So enjoy Season 4 as much as you can. So for the second part of our showcase of everything new for Season 4 of Fortnite, we are going through all the buildings that have been changed or added to the map for you guys to find. So on the west side of the map, right by there, is a evil layer for a i don't know like a, an evil person i don't know it looks kind of cool there's a couple of things in it you know there's there's a couple of things that's just quite nice in there but second thing is right next to junk junction it looks like they've actually built like a warehouse type thing like a movie set that's actually pretty neat um every single picture who's on the screen right now is showing the exact things for all of the locations so um the third place is the motel yes in the trailer you guys probably seen an asteroid hit straight through that sign didn't do that much to it a lorry turned over that's it uh one of the new places as well for the map is um called risky reel so it's very nice it's got a meteor crash straight in the center of it and it's like a reese like a i don't, I don't know really like an old style um movie theater where you just drive up and park your car and all that type of stuff but it's a wrecked movie theater type thing so it's got a load of vehicles everywhere just abandoned and it's nice to have it there's a couple of things there there is a challenge there there's a lot of chests i will say there's a couple of chests there and you can get some of the crystals to jump up uh the next location is actually the superhero mansion as well it's like a um a tony stark type mansion or an x-men type mansion this is more of a a nicer house i will say this is a lot of a 
better and nicer house than what we're used to. So it's it's very nice inside. Um, for my guessing, there is a chest on the roof. And then as well, as soon as you go through some of the rooms as well, there's a lot of weapons all over the place. I did die when I went there, so this is the reason why it's go all on camera instead. But as soon as you go further down, there's a secret passage. And uh, there's actually a secret layer right at the bottom. Where there's a chest that looks like the Avenger symbol or like the, uh, the superhero type symbol. It's a nice thing that actually add to the map. The next location is actually the prison. So the prison, it got destroyed. Um, yeah, don't don't go there. Don't go there. A lot of the chests are gone. Um, so if you are going to go there, don't expect to find a lot of stuff. There was a uh, pit machine as well, or like a, a weapon machine, as soon as you can see in the uh, picture right there. But uh, there's not that much there. Next location is actually on Moisty Myers. So this is like a movie set type thing. It's got a helicopter. It's got um, a camera wheel type thing. Oh, it's got like different stages. It's got green screens as well. I will say as well in um, Risky Wheels, there is a green screen there. I just couldn't get a picture. But um, there's a lot of different places. I feel like they've added in a lot of new chests to the Moisty Myers part of the map. So it is a little bit better to actually have that one. Uh, the next location is actually in Tilted Towers because everybody was just like, oh, Tilted Towers isn't going to be destroyed. It hasn't properly been destroyed. There's an asteroid that's hit it, but one of the buildings is kind of a little bit broken. A little bit broken. Another one right next to it is a little bit broken as well, but it's got a massive hole in the center of it. <laughs> and as well, a lot of these locations have actually got the new stones where you can just jump up and you just jump as high as you can really that's all it's going to be but i will say all of these locations have lost a lot of the chests so i will say to, don't try and go to them as often go towards the newer places or go to the places that don't always have a lot of the stuff so now for the most important thing of the entire update what everybody has been waiting for the special thing that everybody has been waiting for A teddy watching the scarecrow with a chest right in front of it. That's what everybody has been waiting for. This chest. Everybody has to get this chest. Seriously. I'm only joking. It's, it's every single hole in the entire map. So there's about four holes. There's one by here. There's one by here. There's one by here. And there's one by here. And as well, there's actually an added like meteor right by here as well. So it's it's very nice. And then there's just a tiny, tiny hole um, right next to Dusty Depot. And uh, yeah, it, it kind of got a little bit destroyed. So it's... Um, yeah, it's it, it's it's very small. You'll you'll never notice it. You you might you might trip in it at one point. I who knows really. Um, it's 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 really up to you on that one. It's 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 one of those things where it's just it's very in inconvenient in the way of the map. It's it's like the size of a pebble really hitting the hitting a window or something like that. I don't know. Really, it's it's something like that. <laughs> I'm joking. It's it's a massive. It's absolutely massive. Um, it's it's ridiculous, really. It's it's got a um, it's got like a military type base, like a space military type base. You know, like when you have it, it's like on the moon, and you've got like the moon base where you see it in some movies. It's something like that, really. It's like a research type scale type place where it's got like a, a helicopter there, so you can destroy that for metal. There's a lot of metal in in that crater as well i will say and there's a lot of those shards so if people do want to get the super jump type thing use those you will get a massive jump advantage towards people so it will be fun to have shotgun fights with those shards but um yeah i hope you guys enjoy and i will see you guys in another one if you do want to see enough something like this then uh, comment down below and i'll try it out for season five but um hope you guys enjoy and enjoy this season so peace out